late and needed to get somewhere fast? Yes! Actually, I'm, right, I'm late right now. <laughs> Cars, trains, airplanes, and other ways of transportation can solve that predicament. Tune in, grab some popcorn, and listen to our fantastic speech. The wheel was invented in 3500 BC. The first wheel was made in Mesopotamia. It is round with a hole for the axle to go through. The wheel is now made of metal alloys which are lighter and stronger than wood. The wheel changed things for people by making it easier to get around. Fast forward something like 4,000 years to the plane. Have you ever wanted to travel to Japan? Well now you can, with the power of planes. A plane is important, because without it, you can't travel from San Diego to Iceland. The first flight was at Kitty Hawk, an air testing facility, and it was a big success. There were others that tried to invent the plane, but no one did it as good as the Wright brothers. Before to fly, the Lamborghini is another option. Have you ever wanted to travel in style? The Lamborghini is one way to do that. <laughs> did you know that the first Lamborghini was made in 1963 and was made by Fercicio Lamborghini? Yes, he named the car after himself. Fercicio intended the Lamborghini for joyriding, but now it's mainly used for racing. The one place that it won't be rare to see a Lamborghini is Bolognese, Italy, because that's where it was. The speed train was built in 1964. It takes 20 years to build and costs $100 billion. The only places it is located as of now is Japan, France, and China. Hideo Yoshima built the first high-speed train. It cut the journey time between Tokyo and Osaka from six and a half hours to four Speaking hours. of high-speed trains, have you ever wanted to travel 200 miles an hour? Well, a bullet train has the power. The bullet train can go 200 plus miles an hour. It can travel that fast because it uses magnetic levitation. Magnetic levitation helps so there is not as much friction. The bullet train is really useful for traveling. It connects major cities together. The bullet train also passes by Mount Fuji, an active volcano. We started with something as simple as the wheel, and now you can travel by bullet train at 200 miles per hour. Transportation is important because without it, we wouldn't be able to travel the world and discover new places and species. Thanks for watching!